I want to try all the treats. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Happy Valentine's Day. Today's video is not sponsored, but I am using a gift box that was gifted to me by a company called Park Package. They sent me one of their Toy Story candy boxes, which was a perfect gift for Valentine's Day, which I showed you guys on Instagram in case you wanted to buy one for your significant other. But today I decided I would unbox it again on my YouTube and actually try the treats from Hong Kong Disneyland. So first I'm actually going to show you what's inside the box and then if you keep watching we will be trying some treats from Hong Kong Disneyland. I've never ever done this before so I really hope you enjoy this video and if you do I will try and bring some more of these videos to you. So it was packaged beautifully for me by the people at Park Package. They actually messaged me and asked me whether they could send me one, which of course I said yes because I love supporting this small shop. I'm going to leave a link in my description to their shop and if you use the code PARKP you will get 10% off your order. So I got a little Toy Story note that says, Hello Lizzie, thank you for posting this Toy Story candy box on your feed. Your followers can save 10% by using code PARKP. Thank you, Park Package. This is their business card that they have sent me. And then before we get into the candy, there is a lot of goodies in here. So the first one is a forky IMAX picture from Cineworld. I actually told them that my favourite characters were Forky and Duke so that they could add some personalised gifts in there for me. Which they certainly did as they gave me this Forky postcard and this Duke Boom postcard. And then they sent me some really cool stickers from Hong Kong Disneyland. The first one is the Toy Story Alien because I told them I love the aliens as well. And then Buzz too. And then I've got two sets of unopened Toy Story 4 stickers which I have waited until this video to open. So packet number one, I've got Woody holding Forky, I've got a shiny dolly, Woody and Forky again, Woody looking very terrified and then with these Toy Story stickers you also get a trading card and I got Duke Kaboom. And then packet number two, we've got Forky I believe arguing with Woody. I'll need to watch the film again when it comes out on DVD to remember exactly what happens in that scene. And then we've got Woody and Bo, which I absolutely love. And then we've got a shiny Forky and Bonnie all by herself at preschool. Oh, that's really sad. And then I've really looked out today because the other collectible card is another Duke Kaboom, which is really cool. And then they sent me some that were open. So I've got a Forky, a Woody, Woody looking at Bonnie, the Woody holding Forky again, Forky chasing after Woody by the look of it. And then they had already sent me this, which I just got in my unopened packet, but a shiny Duke Kaboom. So they knew how much I love Duke Kaboom. And then I've got a little alien that you can get out of the cardboard and stand up. And then I've got a little make your own Bo Peep, which is really cool as well. And then the main feature of this Toy Story candy box is of course the candy. And it came in a really cute Buzz Lightyear goodie bag like you would get at the end of one of your friend's birthday parties. So he's shooting his laser on this side and then I think he's throwing something on this side. So let's open it up. I already know what I've got, but you guys don't. So for some reason, I didn't realise that the Toy Story candy in the Toy Story candy box would actually be Toy Story themed, so I was really excited. And then I was even more excited when I realised that they came from Hong Kong Disneyland. So the first one I've got is these like chocolate biscuits. I tried these in Tokyo and I absolutely loved them, but I will still be trying them for you. And then I've got some strawberry ones with Ducky and Bunny on. And then I've got two packets of hard sweets and four packets of gummy sweets and as you can see they all say Hong Kong Disneyland so we've got a Buzz, the Aliens, Woody and another Woody so I'll only try one of these so that I can give one to my mum I'm going to try the Alien and then these are exactly the same they have Buzz, Jesse, Woody and the Alien so I'll just take one of those as well and then we've got Woody for the chocolate and Ducky and Bunny for the strawberry and I will just open them and try one of each so that I can let my mum have some when she's home so I'm going to start with these little guys because they're quite crunchy 
Hopefully you won't be able to hear me. So the first one I've got is a little woody. Let's see what he tastes like. That's really nice. They have a generic fruity flavour to them. Very sugary and they're not as hard as they look. They're actually quite easy to bite into. So I've got another woody there. I don't know what flavour they are but they're a lot like something we get in the UK that is like a sugar candy block. And they don't really have an overwhelming flavour either, but they're really nice. So I've got one more woody. They were all like pinky red. And then I've got Buzz and Jesse that are an orangey one. So let's see if they taste like orange. Not overwhelmingly so, but a little bit orange. Because I don't usually eat orange flavoured things. Jesse was slightly harder. So now I'm going to try the strawberry biscuits. So they're all going to be strawberry, but they all have different characters on. So I have picked the three peas in a pod because you never see them on things. You know what? That's actually really nice because even though I don't eat strawberry things, I do eat strawberry pockies and they taste a lot like pockies. So if you can see, it's just a little bit of strawberry cream inside a biscuit and it's really, really good. So I'm going to save the rest of these to eat with my mum when she gets home. And then we've got the chocolate packet. I've decided to choose the sheep, billy goat and gruff. These are exactly like the ones I got on the plane home from Tokyo Disneyland. I'll just leave a link to my playlist because that was an amazing trip. And I'd like to think I showed you quite a lot of the parks. So go and watch that if you haven't already. So that is chocolate cream inside a biscuit and they're just so good. I wish we could get these in the UK because they're one of my favourite things. Again, saving the rest of these to eat with my mum later. I've only just realised Forky was on the packaging as well, what a little cutie. And then finally the gummy sweet. I absolutely love gummy sweets, I get that from my dad so I'll probably let my dad have one of these later. So I chose the one with the aliens on because it's green. There are some orange ones that I've got. And as I don't usually eat orange, I will offer those to my dad. So this is a gummy green alien and it's so, so cute. Let's try it. I think it tastes like apple, but it's really subtle if it is apple. But I really love the texture of it. Sometimes gummy sweets can be too hard, but this is perfectly soft. That was really, really good. It's between... I loved absolutely everything I tried just now, so I can't actually pick a favourite, but oh my gosh, that was one of the best things I've been sent. What a good idea to give you a candy box with actual Disney themed candy inside it. So thank you so much to Park Package for sending me that box. As I said, I'm going to leave the details in the description of where you can get your own and make sure you look around their Etsy site for the other things they sell. I have been sent a few things by them in the past and there is something I've got my eye on that I would like to buy myself, perhaps around my birthday. So I hope you all enjoyed this video. Please give it a big thumbs up if you did and let me know in the comments section down below who your favourite favorite Toy Story character is and why. Make sure you subscribe to my channel if you haven't already and ring the bell so that you're always notified when I upload and I will see you tomorrow for a very exciting collaboration. So make sure you come back tomorrow. Bye guys!